Yo guys, what's up? Welcome back to uh, uh, Evo Creo Part Two. I did a little bit of grinding. I did a, I did a couple things, but I also discovered that uh, Evo Creo Two is actually confirmed, and it's coming out. I've heard two people say June seventeenth, but the picture I'm gonna put up on screen right now says July seventeenth. But uh, yeah, now. We have the Plante. We're gonna have to do the Plante costume. But this dude here, I talked to this dude. Um, hi there. I'm Plante Village's Rad. Rad stands for the Regional Area Defender, Arena Defender. We can be found in regions that have an arena and are known to be the toughest evokers in the region. If you want to go to the Coliseum, then you will need to challenge and defeat all six Rads. You can challenge me after you beat the local arena. I look forward to seeing you again. Welcome to Plante Arena. You'll need to pay a small fee to get in. Pay five dollars? Yes. Good luck. Thank you inside. And you can also, I remember this, you can uh, re-battle uh, these arenas. So that's a good way for EXP. Welcome to the fifth annual Plante Village Creo Tournament. If you have not taken part in this prestigious event, then let me go over the three primary rules of this tournament. First, phase weight. Please wait until the referee announces the match has begun before issuing any commands to your Creo. Second, any combat prior to the match, was start, match start will constitute an instant disqualification from the tournament. Lastly, once the referee has ruled on a match, that decision will be final. I hope your Creo have been adequ adequately trained for this event. Your opponent will be called for when it is time for you to battle. Talk to the referee when you are ready to begin. Good luck. All I have to do is get past you and I get a shot at Leonardo. You're going down. Three battles. Okay, don't care. Let's go. Horatio. Horatio. I don't know. Pa <laughs> uh, it's that thing again? <sighs> We're just gonna set you on fire like we always do. And now I just have to scratch you. Yes! Pepita's fan in 227. Valnot? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and switch Militia in. Oh, they're the same level. I'm gonna switch Militia in to see if Militia can get some uh, screen time. But Militia doesn't have much moves with a lot of, like, never mind, sorry. Um, let's poison him first. Poison spores. I did some off-camera grinding for, like, f four levels for Militia, so he has a couple extra moves now. Level 10, baby. I've been at this a lot longer than you, kid. You don't stand a chance. Let's see about that. Let's see about that, man. Shock. It's probably better than Squirt. Leonardo, the bond between me and Fern is so str We cannot lose. What do you mean? That's mine. That's that's my thing. Why is it pink? Now let's just set it on fire like we always do. It can't fail. Setting your enemy on fire never fails. Keep that in mind. But we're sort of struggling to put him on fire. Come on. This is going to be the one. We're going to set him on fire. Come on, man. No. We didn't have to. Let's go. My normal fern beat your pink fern. You are the worst type of evoker. Leonardo was special and you just ruined what could have been a happy ending. Shut up. Hello there, Blaney. I have already met my colleague, Dr. Finity. Ilm and Dr. Finity. That's who made the game, man. I was sent by my boss to give you an app we just developed called the Creopedia that we used to catalog Creo data. We're looking for talented evokers such as yourself to help us collect Creo data through Zenith. Would you mind helping us acquire Creo data? Of course you wouldn't. Let me see your type for a minute. All right, blah, 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 I don't care. No! Stop it! All right, now we can talk to this dude. You should probably know by now. I'm Plante Villages, right? But being me, you'll be closer to gaining interest in the Coliseum, a place where the best evokers test your skills. If you can beat me, I'll also give you a Creo that I raised on this farm as a gift. So with that out of the way, let's see what you are made of. Okay. He looks so cool. Yeah! No! I'm gonna switch Militia with Fern so that we can get that chip damage in from the very start. And Fern will just be there for backup, to be honest. 27! That's still some EXP. That's, that's... Do I still get the EXP? No. 
I don't think we have to fight him until like a while. So for now, I'm just going to progress ahead and I'll grind up off camera and then I'll fight him on camera. Blaney, I wanted to take a moment to personally congratulate you. That being said, the truth is that we have spent a fortune marketing Leonardo and Fern as a sort of unofficial mascots for this company. We hope that a Leonardo victory would go a far away in convincing Creo owners about the value of genetically modifying their Creo. Tell me, Blaney, have you given any thought to genetically modifying a Creo? You should think about it. Come back later when you decide to genetically modify a Creo. No. I don't want genetically modif- Mmm, there's a bridge. Taku, hey, it's you. I'm your biggest fan. I just saw your match at the Plante Arena. You're a plantastic. Get it? Anyway, I got a career of my own now. Check it out. No one loves you, Taku. Fyroe. Fifteen dog. <laughs> that did a little bit. I need to look up when Fern evolves, man. Because this is just unbearable, man. And we're dead. We lost to our fan. How long is this? 22 minutes. I hope you're happy because that's all you're getting. Actually, let me look up uh, when Militia and Fern evolve real quick. All right, so apparently Fern evolves with like a Gemma or something like a prime Gemma. And I don't think I have any of those. Um, well, I have these. But so that is going to be all for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next Evil Creole episode, man.